How's it going guys? Got another video here for you, a little update. I um, recently picked up a Magpul uh, angled foregrip the other day. Uh, got it here in the in the earth color here, and this is it here. Uh, for my AR pistol, a 7.5 inch 5.56 from Radical Firearms. Um, just slowly putting things on, doing the build here. Um, anyways, just want to do a quick video update uh, showing the foregrip here. So, like I said, this is Magpul M Lock uh, angle foregrip. Um, here it is. Here, uh, this is it. Oh, Flashly came with, uh, of course, your, your screws and your uh, M Lock mounting kit. Um, I put it on, put it on, put a couple rounds through it today. I really like the way it felt. Um, considering that I'm running the seven and a half inch barrel, so it's got a fairly, fairly short rail here. One of the things I found with it was that how the grip came out of the box um, has these little studs here um, on the middle and the back, uh, just to help, I guess, secure it a little better. What I had to do in order to mount it was sand down this this back piece here this little back plastic piece just to uh, i guess it would mount inside the rail itself um because without sanding it down when i put it in because it is so short it left a, a small gap um and wasn't really securely flush with the rail itself so i had to go and sand it down um probably wouldn't be a problem if you had you know the 10 and a half inch or 12 inch barrel um, with a longer uh, rail system. So that's just one of the things that I found uh, to be a little problematic there. So I just took some 60 grit sandpaper um, while I was sitting down and, and sanded it down to make it flush. And uh, that solved that problem altogether there. Found no issues with stability or anything like that after sanding it down or anything like that. So it held held just fine. Um, shot about 60 rounds today and uh, with this mounted on and had no problems so I'll go ahead and I'll install that and I'll show you what that looks like all right so here we go got the uh, angle foregrip here installed um, don't take but you know a couple minutes to install and you see how how sanding on that back edge has, has helped it uh, lay flush against the rail um, you know looks looks pretty good on it Like I said, so you see how your M lock here, that that little uh, plastic tab that was back here to help would would slide in just fine if there was this another uh, another addition on the rail here, but that's not the case with the 7.5 inch. So I uh, just had to, like I said, sand it down, get it on there, um, but you know feels well in the hand, you know able to grip it just fine. So we yeah, just. You know, looks good. Makes a good little addition to it. Um, anyways, picked it up from uh, AT3 Tactical. Uh, got it on their website for about, I think it was $25 or so. Um, with shipping included, it came out to like $34. So I'm in North Carolina, and they're based out of, I think, Minnesota. So anyways, this is it. This is what it looks like with it installed. And you'll see, I got the, I got some flip-up sights on here. I'll do a little review of those here uh, shortly. But, uh, but yeah, I just wanted to show the Magpul angled foregrip on the 7.5 inch. So if you guys have this set up and you're looking for a foregrip, um, you might have to do a little bit of modification on it depending on your rail setup and how it's configured. So anyways, just wanted to uh, throw this out there. If you guys have any questions or anything like that, just uh, put them in the comments below and I'll get them to, I'll get to them as soon as I can. Alright, thanks for watching.